Hi and welcome to this build of uh, my sensors node. To start with, I'm going to build a, a simple my sensors node with a NRF 24L01 plus module, and it's going to be built on the easy PCB. So uh, we have an easy PCB, a radio, a Pro Mini, a couple of pin headers for the Pro Mini. Uh, some capacitors for the voltage regulator uh, and for the radio and uh, screw terminal. So let's see how this go. So we start with the Pro Mini. I don't know why. I just like that, and I I usually start with attaching the, the pin header for the F FTDI connection. So let's see if we, if we have some heat. Sounds good. Maybe we should have some more lights here. Hmm. Not that bad. going to need A4 or A5 so we can just skip it on them on this one something like that So that's the first part, and I already made my first mistake. I need to have this built like this. And this is going to be a 5 volts input. So I need to have a jump on regulated voltage. And in normal cases you can use some sort of jumper and like this well, I normally just 
just bend the pins together. Regulator LE33. It's the one I'm using today. Um, I'm also going to add in the like that. Make sure everything fits good together. And on this side, we're going to have the screw terminal. Something like this. Oops. The screw terminal didn't want to fit there. So let's have a small. Also, I'll go for the radio so you can fix this. Capacitors and uh, legs for the voltage regulator. Let's tidy this up some. Should we go for the screw terminal to begin with? So support to fix it. Looks solid. There we go. The radio. Short, easy fix. Uh, are we happy with that? Guess so. Everything in place now. We need a capacitor for the radio, of course. And what kind of a variation is this? This is we have nine, so we should have ground like this. Something missed. No, I don't think so. Let's try to power this up. And 
see what happens. We have at least the default Promini bootloader blink. So that's fine. So the next step for me will be to cut this down. Uh, so I'll be right back. And there we go. I just used a metal saw and cut it along the, the white line to make it smaller. So um, next step will of course be to, be to add some sort of sensor um, and attach it to, a, to the MIS-X connector. So uh, the next thing I'm going to do is uh, actually uh, upload some sort of test uh, software on this one to see that everything is working. I'm using a time aware sensor example from uh, my sensors. So let me do that. Uh, I can also mention that in most cases I have a pre-built node which is using the time aware sensor sketch which, which has this one loaded and um, the radio module is actually a modular so I can test each radio before soldering them on a board like this. So this radio has been tested here and all I have to do is just plug it in and, and um, fire it up and I can see the response in the gateway or in the logs. So uh, I will fire up the, um, the Arduino IDE uh, on my computer and test it. So let's see if we can get some software on this board. I have a time aware sensor sketch which I uh, normal, normally use something like that. We need to have a port, we need to have the Pro Mini. Uh -huh 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 -huh. We need it to set to 5 volts, 60 megahertz, that's right, and we need a Avery Spanker. So let's see if we can get any software on this one. And it looks like it's uploading. And let's see. Oops. We need to have a water in it. And we have a time value. Sounds good. How about we enable some debug so we can see the radio communication. Uploading. It looks fine. ST OK, OK, OK. So it looks like we have a good solid connection. That's what we want to see before continuing adding sensors to this hardware. Um, and what I normally do now before continuing is erasing the EEP ROM. Currently this node have a node ID 04 and that is going to be changed uh, for the sensor node. Uh, so once I'm finished with the radio tests, um, just clearing the EEP ROM using the, my sensor's standard sketch. 
and you can find that one on the examples scroll down so we find the my census library clear Perón. let's upload that one and it's done thank you for watching let me know if you have any questions just uh, ask and, uh, me on the forum and uh, have a good one thanks for watching